one heart to the right. Okay, so we have random order and switching off. I'm gonna remember switching is off on like that one match. We have Riolu, Nidoran, and Lunatone versus Snowbird, Blossom, and Eren. I guess since I'm soloing right now, I'll um, I'll just work twice as hard. That should be good enough, right? Alright, let's see. We were just getting some commentary details uh, configured. It looks like some people will be able to available to commentate in 30 minutes or an hour or so. So you will get other people after me. I'm just holding it down for now. Snowbird has snow warning, which is nice because snow warning's in chat. Um, random order though, so it's kind of hard to determine how things are going to start off. You know, random order leads to a lot more possibilities. If so there's like nine possibilities for starting, I think. You know, three times three. Hmm. I'd say red team has an advantage though. Because Riolu's good against uh, Snover and Eren. And Nidoran is good against Snover and Blossom. I guess you could say Lunatone is good against Nova as well. While no one on blue team has a particularly good matchup against anyone else. Yeah, I'm commentating right now, Terry. actually played a... I never used Pokemon Box in GameCube, so I didn't know what the music actually sounded like, but I am was pretty sure it'd be similar to the original theme. Feed me. Eek the cat. That's an interesting song name, and it definitely sounds like the music of the era in the 90s. Alright, Snow Warning activates and it's going to be Riolu versus Nover. So basically nothing even changed. The order is still the same. Except switching is off. That's a difference from a normal battle. Ice Shard's going to do moderate damage while Riolu uses Bulk Cup. This ensures that Ice Shard won't be able to kill unless it gets a crit. Alright, now Riolu's gonna be able to use it's a fighting move and it's gonna be able to do good damage after Snowbird uses Ice Shard unless it crits, it's gonna survive handily, do bulk up. He uses Cross Chop, but it misses. Oh no, it didn't miss, it's just Chopple Berry animation delay. So Chopple Berry does good damage and it kills because of plus one attack. I might have survived otherwise due to the Chopple Berry. So Snowbird is down and I assume Blue Team will send in Velocity now. Oh, they sent an Aaron. That's interesting. I guess they're going to hope that they survive an earthquake because they're outsped right now. Oh, but they use Cross Chop, which is even better. There goes Aaron. I don't know if I would have switched into Aaron if I was blue team. They don't have Gen 5 Sturdy. It had Rock Head anyway, so even if it was Gen 5, it still would have died. Blossom probably would have been a better pick there because. They didn't even need Cross Chop to kill Eren. With plus one, they could have killed with Quad Effective Earthquake, which would have had 400 power after factoring in type coverage. Riolu should still be faster than Blossom, so it'll get another hit in with a plus one Cross Chop with Stab. And it gets a crit, ending the game. Red had moderate RNG, but they played well enough anyway. 
GG's to blue. Uh, red gets their 27% payout, I guess. This is pretty emotional victory music for such a methodical and clean victory. But it does kind of give me imagery of there being like a snowy town or something, you know, with the warmth of being able to stay inside and whatnot. And it was snowing due to snow warnings, so I guess it can fit to some degree. Alright, we got break now with the night music from Mitomo. I never played that game myself. Kind of reminds me of some Animal Crossing type of music. Alright, so we got three clues for who's that Pokemon. We've got question mark attacks and swarms, making them sink. Although it is said to be a very vicious Pokemon, it timidly flees as soon as it finds itself alone. Two, it lives in massive rivers that course through jungles. It swarms prey that enter its territory. Three, looking into its cute round eyes makes it start singing a song so pleasant listeners can't help but fall asleep. Well, the thing I see here is that there's both swarms in one and two, so that sounds more likely than three. But what Pokemon is it that swarms is very vicious and lives in rivers? I guess we'll find out when the time runs out. Thank you everyone for supporting Twitch Plays Pokemon. I'm going to be commentating solo for maybe another 30 minutes until Lumi Sao is able to commentate and then Brian, in 30 minutes or so, then Brian the Gamer will be able to join her in about an hour from now. So that's what's coming up soon enough. I hope that I'm doing a good enough job for you guys by myself. Seems to be no token matches yet. Fortunately, I think I can solo commentate pretty well because I have a large amount of thoughts in my head at all times and I've gotten better at organizing it, so that means I don't really run out of things to say too much. Oh, thanks, Shadow Puppet. Lots of Ohio's in chat. What's the occasion? I was kind of looking at the screen, so I didn't quite see why everyone's spamming Ohio. I mean, I like the emote personally. It's always nice to have some cuteness and some positivity, happiness, and weebishness. I'm kind of a weeb, admittedly. Not really too much, but maybe a little. To be fair, I am partially Japanese, so it's not like it's that bad. Okay, we have some populated uh, co we have some populated matches now for token betting. I guess we'll see which one wins. Mosu is in the lead with two right now, with Totodile, Carvana, Delibird, Chansey, Snover, and Meowth. And I guess that will win unless someone snipes at the last second. It is Carvana. That's kind of what I thought. I thought maybe it could be Sharpedo, but they probably mentioned it's Jets or something. Okay, see you, Gary Oak. Yeah, I'm glad that Snowver, uh, that Snow Warning has a snow badge. Snowbird badge. Alright, looks like they're going to move up and they're going to push the heart block to the right one space which will clear both of them with the moves that they have left. I have Ribombi badge which is one of my favorite po-